Daisy. Hi, Mira. Today we will do two easy pom pom projects. We will also learn about how potential energy converts into kinetic energy. The things that we need for this project is tape, a pencil, a cardboard tube, a balloon, a paper or plastic cup, scissors, rubber bands, hole puncher, and pom poms. I know this project was really fun and awesome. Ishi, I like to play with this, but can you tell me how it works? These are this popper and that shooter are examples of kinetic and potential energy. When you pull down on the balloon and on the rubber band, you are creating potential energy. Letting go of them makes the potential energy turn into kinetic energy, the energy of motion. The kinetic energy then transfers to the pom-pom, making the pom-poms launch like that. If you want the pom-pom to go really far, you need to pull down as much as you can without breaking. That creates a lot of kinetic energy, which transfers to the pom-pom and makes the pom-pom go really far. We really enjoyed these two easy pom-pom projects. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more upcoming learning activities. Thanks for watching! Bye!